In the last few years, Pakistan cricket has been constantly hit by the claims of spot fixing. In order to overcome it completely, Pakistan Cricket Board PCB has even come up with the zero toleration policy against the fixes but the things don't seem to improve a bit. According to reports, the Cricket Board is now all set to hold investigations to find out if two more players were allegedly involved in spot fixing. As per latest reports of Jang, newspaper, the names of batsman Umar Akmal and fast bowler Mohammad Sami were frequently mentioned during the testimony recorded by the operations officer of the UK National Crime Agency prior to the three-member anti-corruption tribunal of the board last Thursday. Sources in PCB revealed that they could not send any notice or charge sheet to the two players because there wasn't any conclusive evidence against the two violating any of the PCB's anti-corruption code. The names were mentioned in the testimony and it was revealed by the NCA official that the bookmaker Mohammad Yusuf took the names several times, one source claimed. The names of the two players have emerged out during the ongoing hearings into the PCB charge sheet against Pakistani batsmen Sharjil Khan and Khalid Latif who were charged for violating several clauses of the anti-corruption code including meeting with bookmakers and agreeing to spot fix in the Pakistan Super League earlier this year in Dubai. The two players were sent back from the PSL after being suspended under the anti-corruption code by the PCB. The board later on also suspended four other players which include the left-arm pacer Mohamed Irfan, who is serving a 12-month ban after admitting to not reporting approach as bookmakers Mohamed Nawaz, Shahzib Hassan and Nazir Jamshid, all Pakistan players. While the 27-year-old Umar Akmal skipped the ongoing high-performance camp in Lahore and apparently flew to London in order to take medical treatment for a knee problem, the 36-year-old Mohammed Sami, who has played 36 tests and 87 odors, is currently in Karachi.